Hello students, welcome back to our mathematics class. I hope you are well at home and you are enjoying our online classes and you are sol solving our worksheets daily. I think so. So please watch our videos and just do your work, daily work, daily basis. If you have any problem, ask me in any uh, problem in any comment section okay so let us start our today's topic that is what problems on subtraction what is what problem first of all we need to know that what problem means story problem in mathematics the question will comes in the form of a story so here you have to find out the problem first. Means what kind of problem it is. Either it is subtraction or it is addition. What kind of what problem it is you have to find out. Then you have to solve it. To solve the what problem, very carefully you have to read the question. Because if you read the question carefully, then you will find out some clues there. To help you, I have listed few clue words here, which will help you to understand the problem is on subtraction. I have listed out few clue words here. If you know more from me, then please write down in the comment section, which will help us to know that this is also a clue word of subtraction. So let us read the Clue words, what I have written here. First clue word is minus, less, difference, more than, less than, fewer than, how many more, how many left, remain, take away, decrease by, and also some ear types word. Ear type words means, ear type word, word means which will finish by ear, like faster, larger, shorter, slower, higher. This kind of word, if you find out from in a problem, then it will be a subtraction. Please remember this word problem, these clue words. Now, I will give you one trick to solve the word problem easily. That is buck, B-U-C-K. First of all, whenever you get the word problem, you read the question carefully. Then you follow this bark. Here, bark represents another things. B for box the question. First of all, you need to box the problem of the question. Then, underline the info needed. What information is given, which is needed push part, you have to underline. Then, Circle the clue word. You have to circle the clue word. Then K means knock out the unneeded part which will not help you. You just leave it. No need to look on the unneeded part. So if you follow back then you can easily solve the word problem. So now I will discuss few problems. And how to write the problem means how to write the statement and how to solve the what problem of subtraction. So now we will solve our first problem. To solve the problem first of all we need to read the question carefully. There are 467 students in a class in a school. And 235 students are girls. How many boys are there in the school? To, we have to follow Buck. So first of all, we need to box the problem. How many boys are there in the school? This is our problem. We need to find out. Then we have to underline the information needed. Like 467 students are there in the school 
and 235 students are girls among them. Then now we have to circle the clue word that is how many. So from the clue words we understand that we have to subtract. So now we can start our answer. To solve the what problem of subtraction we need to write the statement properly. To write the statement we have to read the question very carefully. From the question you can make your statements. Like first statement will be total number of students in the school equals to 467. See in the underlying part we have get this statement. Then total number of girls in the school is 235. Must put the place back, places. See, I have written here 1, 10 and 100 because it is a 3 digit number and it is also a 3 digit number. Now, as we understand that it is, it is a subtraction, so I have to put here subtraction sign. So, total number of boys we have to find out. So, we have to write here total number of boys uh, in the school is equals to First of all, we need to subtract the 1's place, 7 minus 5 equals to 2. Then 10's place, 6 minus 3 equals to 3. Then 100 place, 4 minus 2 equals to 2. So, how many boys are there in total? 232 boys are there in the total in the school. See, we have not complete our answer. Because if we not write the final answer... We will not complete our answer. To give the final answer, we need to put this sign. This is called therefore sign. So, must put this sign and start your final answer. Therefore, 232 boys are there in the school. This is our answer of our first question. So, I think you have understand the word problem of subtraction how to solve and how to uh, recognize that which kind of what problem it is and how to write the statement you have understand i will give you more example so now we will solve our next question mina read 32 pages of a book and rina read 30 13 pages fewer than mina how many pages read by Rina. So, here we have to box first means the problem is how many pages read by Rina. How many pages read by Rina. Here the given part is Mina read 32 pages of a book and Rina read 13 pages fewer than Mina. So, the clue word is fewer than and how many? So, from the clue words, we can easily understand that it is a subtraction. We have to do subtraction. Now, the statement part. So, let us solve it by writing the statement. The statement is number of pages Mina read. 32. 1's and 10's place you have to put. Then, Number of pages Rina read fewer than Mina. 13. Now it is a subtraction. So put the subtraction sign. Then first of all so do the operations of 1's place. That is 2 minus 3. So it is impossible. We, the minuend is 2 and subtrahend is 3. It is impossible because we can't subtract it. Then we have to borrow from 10's place. See, I have taken 10 from here. So, it will become 3 become 2 and 2 become 12. Then, 12 minus 3 equals to 9 and 2 minus 1 equals to 1. So, number of pages, Rina read 19. So, the final answer is 19 pages read by Rina. In this way, we can easily solve the word problems of 
subtraction and here we have learned that the clue word fewer than we can use to understand the subtraction let us start our third question see roma had rupees 750 she bought a pizza of 4 rupees 325 how much money is left with rama see we have to follow bark that means box the problem first see i have pro first box the problem how much money is left with rama this is our problem how much money is left with rama then we have to underline the needed information what is the information given here Roma had rupees 750 and she bought a pizza for rupees 325. See, I have underlined this part. Then we have to circle the clue word. Here, first clue word is left with means it is very known to us that left or that means left with remain. This means subtraction. So, it is a subtraction. Now we have to write the statement. See, I have written here amount of money Rama had, rupees 750. Amount of money Rama spent, rupees 325. Must write the unit here. This is new thing for you. That's the unit of money is rupees. For so must put the rupees. Then uh, we have to subtract one place. See, 0 minus 5, we can't subtract because minuend is 0 here. So, we have to borrow 10 from 10's place, the neighbor place. That means, uh, then 5 will become 4 and 0 will become 10. 10 minus 5 equals to 5 and 4 minus 2 equals to 2. Then, 7 minus 3 equals to 4. So, money left rupees. 425. So, money left with Roma is 425. In this way, you can easily... So, we have come to our last question. That is, question number 4. Nita run 125 kimi in 1 hour and Rita run 525 kimi in 1 hour. Who run faster by how much? See, who run faster? This question... We will get to know from uh, the comparison. See, if we compare the number first, we, which number is bigger one? 525 is the bigger one. So, who run faster? Rita run faster. Now, we have to calculate that by how much? Rita run faster by how much? Means Rita cover how, how many Kimi more than Nita? To know this, we have to subtract. Then I have written the statement like this way. Distance covered by Rita equals to 525 kimi. Distance covered by Nita equals to 125 kimi. Now I have given a subtraction sign. Now just I, one, by, one by one column I have subtracted. 5 minus 5 equals to 0. 2 minus 2 equals to 0. And 5 minus 1 equals to 4. So the difference is 400 kimi. Rita run faster than Nita by 400 kimi. In this way, we can solve our subtraction word problem. If you have any queries, you can write down in the comment section. I will try to help you. And till then, goodbye.